Hello children and welcome to today's online class. So children, we have been learning chapter triangle and in our first segment of the chapter we learned about the area of scalene triangle. In today's online class we will be learning the area of right angled triangle. Children you all know what is right angled triangle. If a triangle has one angle as 90 degree then the triangle is said to be right angle triangle in which this is called perpendicular or we can say height this is called base this is base and this is our hypotenuse so area of such triangle we have learned several times the area of right angle triangle is half into base into height so based on this formula today i have a question here so children let us discuss the question that i have written on the whiteboard so my question says the figure abcd represents a square of the side 6 cm so here abcd this abcd is a square having side 6 cm that means all sides are 6 cm in length because square has all four sides equal now next the area of triangle ADF you can see children ADF is a triangle and it is a right angle triangle because children the four corners the four vertices the four corners the four vertices of square have has 90 degree so that means there is 90 degree here so we can say this is a right angled triangle so you have to find the area of triangle adf so you have to find the area of this right angle triangle but there is one condition given and this the area of triangle ad sorry sorry is not to find the area the question says the area of triangle ADF, so this ADF is one third of the area of the square. Okay, the area of this triangle, right angle triangle ADF is one third of the area of whole square. So whatever is the area of square, it's one third is the area of this right angle triangle ADF. Now find the length of FD you have to find this FD that means you have to find the base of triangle but height is given height means perpendicular is already given now you can say where it is given no it is given how because AD is one of the side of a square and square all sides are equal 6 6 that means CD is 6 AD also is 6. So that means AD is given. Who is not given? Base. FD is not given. So let us follow a technique. So let us begin our solution. Children, here the area of right angle triangle is connected with the area of square. So let us begin from area of square. You can write area of square equal to side square or side into side or edge into edge edge also we say okay let me write side into side side of a square two times we have to multiply side of a square is 6 that means 6 into 6 36 as it is given in centimeter so we will write centimeter square now therefore the area of triangle ADF the area of triangle ADF is one third of one third of the area of square that means you multiply by 1 by 3 one third means 1 by 3 you have to multiply with the area of square then the whatever answer will come it will be the area of triangle ADF so you can cancel our answer is 12 centimeter square so we came to know children that the area of triangle ADF is 12 centimeter square because the relation was given now children please point to be noted 
our perpendicular height is given but our base fd you have to find the length of fd fd is not given now what we can do children since area of triangle adf is half into base into height or perpendicular and its value half into base into height is the area of triangle and its value is 12 so i can write 12 here this area value i can put here because i have told you if any formulas value is given then we can apply formula and write the value i have told you in the class also so i can write half into my base name is fd write fd into height height name is ad you can write ad and equal to 12 is the area of your triangle now half into fd into ad ad is the side of a square and side of a square is given as 6 write 6 here and 12 is our areas value you can cancel 2 and 6 numerator denominator and numerator 2 3 just 6 now fd equal to this multiplication will go and be divide there will become divide 3 goes and divides so 3 4 the 12 therefore your value of fd is 4 centimeter find the value of fd the value of fd is 4 centimeter that means whenever the area of right angle triangle is given you have to use the formula as half into base into height if you are asked to find height from there you can find height and when you are asked to find base from there only you can find base but the condition is area value of area should be known to us i hope children you understood thank you children